Hey friends, what's up? Uh, I'm here with another Tottenham Hotspur update. Look at my new area, right? Isn't it fun and great? Um, I had prepared like, you know, two hours uh, worth of like research and stuff for making a video on Paulo Fonseca. And, you know, I was watching games from Roma. I was watching games from like, you know, snippets from Pacos de Ferreira and, you know, all that stuff. I was doing all the good things, watching interviews, watching documentaries from Shakhtar Donetsk, where I think he did a brilliant job. And it fell through again. Um, also, I, I have this, right? Is this better? Does this look better to you? Or should it be off? I don't know. Anyways, we're going to leave it on for right now. I'm so mad. I'm so mad yet again because just like Antonio Conte and just like a few other managers, we were so close to appointing Paulo Fonseca. And it seems like we just freaking let him off without even like really consulting with him about it, which is really sad. And I feel bad for him, honestly, because he seemed like a really, really good fit. And I hate it. I hate it now because... <laughs> He, he was, like, ideal. He was young. He was a really progressive manager. He had a lot of good ideas that I agreed with. He seemed like a good person. Um, and I was ready to jump on board. Yeah, not the biggest name. Yeah, not what we expected. Um, but I was ready to give it a try, of course. And then Tottenham goes and does Tottenham. So we're back at square one. Uh, I don't know what the hell Paratici is doing. But he wanted to sign Gattuso. <sighs> Mate. Get the... Get out. If you genuinely thought that was a good idea. Um, I really, really hope Paratici doesn't just know about Italy and is hiring managers from a like list of like five names where he's like oh yeah that guy's italian or that guy worked in italy that's not how we should work we should just hire the best candidate for the job please um the most concerning thing about all of this is the fact that it's so evident we have no plan whatsoever like if you look at the amount of different kinds of managers we've gone after there is no like consistent thing like we went after Antonio Conte we went after Mauricio Pochettino we went after Ayrton Hogg we went after Paulo Fonseca we've gone after like every single kind of manager and that just kind of proves we have no freaking direction like we don't really know what what we want which is Stupid, just follow the freaking letter that Levy sent, you know? Like, if we had a plan, right? Like, hire a young progressive coach. That's all you need. Just get freaking Graham Potter, okay? Like, I'm done. I just, <laughs> just want I just want a project manager. I just want a long-term manager who plays some nice football and won't freaking murder his players in press conferences, okay? Like, that's all I want. That's all I want. Um... Yeah, yeah, <laughs> like hire grandfather, hire freaking, at this point, you know, if, if it was Gattuso or, um, or feckin' what's his name, Ryan Mason, I would take Ryan Mason, I <laughs> literally take Ryan Mason, dude, it's so screwed up, I hate it, I hate what we're doing, I, I don't understand it at all, uh, yeah, I'm watching the Euros. I mean, I'm not, like, that invested because I, you know, I like watching England and stuff, and that's how I got into soccer, but, yeah, it's not, like, the biggest interest for me. Anyways, Tottenham, Tottenham stuff, um, but, yeah, I was planning on making a fucking career mode, uh, in FIFA with Fonseca's tactics, because I actually think they're really interesting, or at least his latest implementation of tactics, um, but obviously that fell through, and I really, really just want to have something to work the freaking content off of, because I want to, I want to, like, keep this channel going, and there's nothing to do, right, there's no, there's no content, there's no content to make, I'm playing Chivalry, 
too. Do you want to see some chivalry too? I don't know, dude. I was like, <laughs> we're just, we're just pogging out, right? Like, whatever, whatever, right? We're, we we got to do what we got to do. Um, I'm having a great time in Seattle, if you want an update. Um, it's a nice place here. I'm, I'm having a good time. It's nice and coolish. Um, but yeah, no, I hope you're all doing well. I hope you're invested in the international tournament and not worried about Tottenham right now. I can't help but still be worried about Tottenham and really, really hoping that Paratici isn't off his head um, and actually appoint someone who is decent. Um, Valverde is a name that's come up recently, and I think a lot of people are positive about that um, in the analytical community. So that's good. I mean, it's just, uh, there's another video just saying I'm upset because um, a lot of content creators like even put out videos already or made videos already or had plans to make videos already um that just got scrapped again because Tottenham suck and uh we didn't want to point uh Fonseca for some reason which is really disappointing honestly I really liked that appointment the idea of that appointment but what can you do it's Tottenham um Hopefully we get some more news next week. Um, yeah, seven to ten days, right? <laughs> that meme. Okay, well, now I'll see you guys later. Let me know if you do want to see any content. I will be glad to share it with you. Uh, I love you all so much. Thank you for watching. Uh, leave a like and subscribe. I will be working soon, probably. So we'll see if I can keep the content going. But in the meantime, I hope you have a great day. I'll see you next time. Come on, you Spurs.